They're getting more brazen all the time. An assault on Pittsburgh's North Shore during Sunday's Steeler game injured four first responders. One of those police officers wound up at the hospital with a bloody nose and a concussion. Katie Kay's Megan Schiller joining us now after learning some people are upset that suspect walked out of jail. According to the court paperwork, Ronald Snow paid zero dollars and is out of jail, not due back until the end of the month. And this is following an alleged assault that happened right here on this sidewalk, reportedly injuring three police officers and one medic. A mid-game drunken brawl Sunday landed this Churchill man in jail. It's terrible, first of all, that uh, something like that happens. It's uh, clearly not necessary. Mike Suckage owns the North Shore Tavern, where police arrested Ronald Snow. Three officers found snow as he walked into these doors after allegedly attacking a medic on a motorcycle outside McFadden's bar down the street. There used to be to a point where even if you were drunk, if you saw the police, it made you a bit wiser right away, right? Because you didn't want to take that extra step and certainly not get physical. Court paperwork says snow did just that resisting arrest and allegedly assaulting all three officers on this sidewalk. Snow allegedly kicked one officer in the face using the heel of his boot, causing his head to snap back. Snow allegedly kicked another officer square in the chest and hurt the other officer's eye. Despite the alleged violent attack, though, paperwork shows Snow's out of jail, released on his own recognizance, meaning he didn't pay any bail, but promises to appear in court as scheduled. It's unfortunate that, um, that something like that would enable somebody to be released so quickly. I mean, if it were me, they, they should be still sitting there right now. Uh, waiting it out behind bars. City of Pittsburgh police confirmed the injuries to KDKA today. I called over to the magistrate's office to try to learn a little bit more about why someone facing several felony charges would be immediately let out, but I couldn't get through to anyone. It does not appear that Snow has retained a defense attorney. Reporting tonight on the North Shore, Megan Schiller, KDKA News.